Hello everyone, in this tutorial I will be showing how to make a simple main menu in Godot 4. So to start, select user interface, this will create a new scene. You can rename this to menu or anything you want. Add a margin container node. And then within that node, add a VBox container node. Within here, you're going to add the buttons you want. So, let's have a button for play. And you can press Control D to make a new button. You can name this Options, and then a new button for Exit. Or Quit. Okay, now you can go to each button, and within the text option, you can title them. And it will show up in the game. Now to make these buttons work, we can add a new script to the menu node. And in here, you don't need these. Alright, now to connect the buttons. We click one, go to node, and go to pressed. Then we select menu. This will connect it and will allow us to uh, do a you know certain function on, on it on when we press it. So now do that for each button. Okay. So we could start with the quit because that will be the easiest. All you do is get tree with two parentheses dot quit. That will quit out of the executable or uh, the editor. So if you press play, it will just close out that window. For play, it'll be quite similar. So you will have obviously your game scene. So if I go make a quick, if I save this, I can make a new 2D scene. You don't have to follow along with this. You will already have a uh, game scene. So let's All right. So you can now take your game scene. Uh, you already have one. So follow along with the, whatever you have saved your main scene as, uh, maybe it's called level one. Uh, we could do get tree dot change scene and then we to file game scene this will change the this will move from the menu to the main game if we select current we select play as you can see we're now in our game scene and if we press quit it will quit out so now for the options menu I am not going to be going in too in depth into the actual options menu itself, but I will be showing how to set it up. So what we can do is duplicate our menu scene, call it options menu or whatever you would like, duplicate, and we open that. We can detach this original script, and we don't need these buttons. We can delete these. We can create new buttons. We could do one B volume or whatever options you're going to have in your game. But also we need a back button. This one's going to be important and I will be going how to hook this one up. So call it back. This will have us go back to the main menu. Okay. New script and we will connect our back button. I'm pressed, connect. Okay, going back to our menu. We will be doing the same thing we did with our game scene. But we will going to we will go to options menu. And we can go to our options menu and we can go to our menu. 
press play. Press options. And we press back. We can now go between menus. All right, I hope you guys found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to comment them down below. If you have any suggestions for current or future videos, please also let me know down below. Otherwise, please hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you.